Good morning, Tom Beal here coming to you from the beach in Costa Rica in Esterios Este. And last night, roughly 19 kilometers from here, there was a 6.5 magnitude earthquake uh, here in Costa Rica. So uh, a group of us were sitting in uh, there watching a movie that we could learn some lessons on investing about and uh, the room started shaking, the floor started shaking. And when the floor shook at first, it reminded me of the train coming by. Uh, but I realized there's no trains anywhere near here. So uh, what, what's going on? And then it shook harder and I stood up and said, uh, earthquake. And we got outside. Uh, it didn't do anything after that last large shake. Um, and didn't feel any after aftershocks or anything like that last night. Maybe in the middle of the night when I was sleeping, uh, but I don't know. And then this morning I did feel a little bit. I haven't uh, gone online to confirm that, but I felt something moving a little bit in the room. But all is well. And after doing some Googling and seeing what happened, I also noticed there were two other earthquakes uh, in the world at the same approximate time. Uh, and the one in Iran uh, was deadly. Buildings collapsed and people were actually killed. So I'm very thankful that uh, this one didn't have any major damage. I mean, there are things falling off the shelf and minor glass and things broken, but nobody was injured. And my heart goes out to uh, those who lost family members in Iran. Uh, and I'm, I didn't see any casualties from the other one. I think it may have been in Japan or, or somewhere else. Um, but, you know, lives were lost in uh, the earthquake in Iran. This was a 6.5. Iran was 7.4 or something like that. And buildings collapsed. So uh, that was my first earthquake. And it was literally, it, it shook me a little bit. Uh, the earth has never rumbled and it, and it wasn't just like a shaky earth it was like a moving like a like a mole climbing under you and it, and it was on a floor that had had tiles etc and you could feel a rolling movement which freaked me out a little bit so it was my first one uh, and uh, just super thankful you know for those things we take for granted sometimes life has a way of showing us uh, expect the unexpected but uh, adds another level of gratitude here as I prepare for the day at the beach and I just want to pass that along to you you know things will happen uh, life happens my routine in the morning I try to just get grounded and focus on the things that I'm grateful for and then set my intention for the day if nothing else were to happen but this what would make today a success and each day this may be a little bit different but I set I set my clear intentions and do my best to make today and every day great. So hope this message finds you well and possibly consider some things to think about what you're grateful for in your life, regardless of if you're at the pinnacle and things are working tremendously well or you might be in a little crevice, things not going so well. What are you grateful for today? Set your intentions to make today great. Talk with you soon. Make today great. Oh, by the way, the 30-day challenge I mentioned a couple days ago kicks off in less than 48 hours. you got to be a part of that. Like, seriously, take your life and your results to the next level. Challenge yourself. Push yourself. My friend Nisande is going to be assisting and guiding that journey for 30 days. And trust me, the dude is a, a, a miracle worker. The dude helps people break through limiting beliefs, break through procrastination, break through things that are holding them back from reaching their full potential. I'm going to be participating in it, and I don't want you to miss it. Go to TomBeal.com, T-O-M-B-E-A-L.com, forward slash H-H-W-W. TomBeal.com, forward slash H-H-W-W. That 30-day challenge begins in less than 48 hours, and I want you to have a solid foundation to ensure you finish this year as strongly as possible and set yourself up. Set yourself up set yourself up for the most amazing year in 2018. All right, I'll see you in the 30-day challenge. Go to there, uh, go there now, tombeal.com forward slash HHWW, and make today great.